afternoon everybody yeah, yes, good you are energetic <laughs> and i am happy that you all of, most of you are smiling you keep smile all through all through four years <laughs> not now so all through four years you have to keep smiling so yes uh, i think you have finished your lunch and uh, once again as the chairman i welcome you to the vignan family <laughs> thank you good perhaps uh, you, you have entered this uh, course orientation course uh, with an idea that uh, from tomorrow onwards from the second day onwards third day onwards the physics mathematics and these courses would be started naturally it was happened in the school it was happened in the intermediate but no course is started at that's the yes no course is started at they are uh, all through they are telling something else so why all these things so this is the why this orientation actually you require physics mathematics c language these things but they are not uh, uh, they are not uh, taught now they are they are teaching something else why this <laughs> yes because yes you should know the basic things of your life why you are coming to the college you have i don't think you have a right answer why you are studying you don't have the right answer why you are working hard you don't have the right answer what is the way to uh, to make you win in the game i mean in the game means uh, yes in the life so you don't have the answer without knowing the answers for all these things if we start mathematics or physics or something else it you yeah, are a confused individual you are totally confused individual you should know what for i am studying what for i am coming to the college what for i am doing work what for i am yes this you should know it then uh, you can do wonders on your own yes we have ample time don't worry about the time uh, about physics chemistry and all that because ours is the first college first university started the classes no other university has started the classes so far we are the first people to start it so we have ample time to teach you all this don't get worried about your subjects so Sub, uh, once you are ready for that once you are uh, ready for the game you can do it on your own also we teach no doubt but you can do it on your own also that happens in the sports in a sports when somebody wins the gold medal at the national level or international level the trainer's role is very simple the the sportsman works uh, day and night i to i to be the champion i should do well i should do good i should win the game yes that, he works 90% the trainer's role is only 10 to 20% yes once you are into that nobody can stop you that is the process what we are doing now for this 10 15 days yes if you know the real answers if you know the real potential if you know what you can do what height you can reach yes it is it is your job you are going to play well yes so the first thing uh, first course is first thing is so why we do if i ask you many i told you the, uh, this i mean i told you same thing on the first day also if i if i ask you the basic things like why are you coming to the college why are you coming regularly to the college why are you working so hard for all these things your answers are something your answers are because everybody is coming i am coming to the college or my 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 parents paid the fees they wanted you wanted me to, to go to the college so yeah, i am coming to the college or my teachers won't accept if i don't come to the college that is what you have experienced in your intermediate and other courses or in your school also but uh, yes you never say an answer that it is for my for my sake 
Yes. You never say that it is uh, working for myself. I am working for my parents. I am working for my teachers. I am working for my fellow students. I am working for something. <coughs> never say that I am working for myself. What is the work you have to do for yourselves? The basic thing, the first thing is you have to set your goal. What is, uh, yes, you have to set your goal. What is it you want it to become? So based upon your performance, based upon the condition of your family, based upon, yes, mo I know most of your parents have come to me. They are with one acre land, with uh, doing uh, simple labor, uh, struggling hard to pay your fees. And uh, there are some people are there with five, six acres of land, but they are not getting the enough revenue because uh, sometimes the crop is not uh, good, sometimes the rates are not good, sometimes the rains are not good. Because of all these reasons, even though they have five, ten acres, yes, people are uh, suffering. And you know pretty well some of you are suffering or your families are suffering when there is a disease in your family. Uh, yes, you don't have money. You have to ask two, three people around. And then you have, have a, if you have a function, you don't have money. You have to ask uh, five, six people and uh, depend upon your relatives. This is the status for many families. More than 60, 70 percent of the families. Yes. This, uh, I, uh, the people come to me explaining the things. What is it they are doing? What? Yeah, this is the uh, kind of uh, horrible situation. We can't uh, celebrate Sankranti uh, happily. We have to get the money from three, four people. We can't treat the, uh, somebody who is sick in the hospital uh, very, uh, I mean, normally. We have to, uh, uh, I mean, go around the, around the people for sake of money. What is this nonsense? Should not be that thing. We should, you should not see that kind of situation after four years. That is possible with you. That is possible when you are, uh, when you get a good uh, placement, with a package of seven, eight lakhs, that's a beautiful thing. Or sometimes it is a, with a package of 10, 15 lakhs, it is more beautiful thing. So that is the way you have to, yes, uh, fix your goal. Yeah, these, these uh, I mean, the family, what you are seeing should not be there after four years. These. Uh, the difficulties or issues or the problems you are facing every day in and day out should not be there after four years. Once you become something, once you become, you are getting settled. The, not only you, you, the whole family gets settled and come out of this, yes. So once you get settled with seven, eight lakhs uh, job, Yes, you'll have a good car, you'll have some re reasonable life, good house, all these things will happen. That should be the dream. That should be your goal. Yes, my parents should not suffer after four years. My family should not suffer after four years. My, yes, uh, uh, for small things, for small uh, Requirement, I should not depend on anybody. I should not request or beg anybody. This should be the thing. So I have to make up my mind, I to uh, yes, to have a great job, great settlement in my life. That is the goal. Now the answers would be different. So what the questions I asked initially, so the answers would be different. It is not for parents or for the, I mean, for the teachers. So why you are coming to the college to reach my goal, to make my life beautiful? Why you are coming regularly to the college? Yes, I should uh, do better than others. Why you are ha working hard uh, more than 10 hours, 15 hours a day? 
because i to come out of this i should uh, come out of these problems i should be better than others my life and my, the entire family should be beautiful life is beautiful if you if you see the movie your life cannot be beautiful you have to make your life beautiful that's it it is in your hands you have to life you have to make your life a very beautiful life so once the goal is set for you so the whole thing gets changed the whole process gets changed you need not depend upon uh, you need that the, your parents need not ask you to go to the college you need not uh, the teachers won't need not punish you uh, to not for not uh, for not coming to the college or need not bother you need not pressurize you or anything because you are doing everything on your own because your mind is set to reach that goal yes everything would be good you are working for yourself not for anybody so that is the way you have to set your goal depending upon your uh, uh, your uh, family situation depending upon your situation you have to set your goal beautifully the goal may be good placements as i told you for uh, poor students and all that uh, average middle class students your aim should be placements and for some students your aim should be higher education and very few students who got already money uh, yeah can be entrepreneurs uh, you can employ you can start a business and employ some more people so this anything may be your goal of course i told you because most of you are from middle class and lower middle class as i understand so for you most of you the placement and the then only family gets settled yes so somebody may ask me sir my father is a businessman he is uh, full of money he is full of uh, uh, i mean uh, i mean uh, assets large number of assets we have 100 crores 200 crores why should i bother about all these things why should i come to the college why should i be regular why should, why should i be punctual i am telling you for those kind of people see for a human being three phases would be there the first phase is ba the com uh, basic things like food shelter this is having some house or shelter, taking some the second phase is comforts having a good car and good uh, air conditioned house all these things second phase the third phase which is the most important phase is the identity recognition yes i should be identified as something i should not be identified with my father i should not be identified with my grandfather i should not be ident yeah i should be identified by myself yes though you have riches though you have this thing if you don't have the job nobody bothers your own friends won't bother about you or you don't have, if you don't have education nobody bothers about you if you have a, though you have 100 crores but even then you got the job and uh, uh, the job you have uh, rejected that is the beauty and you, you need to have recognition in the society that's it see the real punishment is not to the poor or middle class people real punishment is the rich people because you can't get the identity easily you are living okay reasonably well people always say look it is because his father earned so much or he, they got so much uh, money they got so much uh, property so he is earning he has nothing suppose in my case also if the krishna is doing the same thing what i am doing nobody bothers about him because rattayaru has built so many institutions established so many institutions he is doing it what is the greatest with him 
because he is in other field like politics he is recognized differently than other than me yes he is totally recognized in a different way if he is with me he, even if he earns more money than me or more things than me does the more things than me nobody bothers because his father has given everything and given a full plate so he is enjoying it nobody bothers is about his intelligence nobody bothers about his work or something something so for even for the rich people also those who got money your problem is much more uh, heavier suppose a poor man takes one step people always start appreciating oh this poor man makes lots of things but as a rich man if you make a reasonable with reasonable speed also society won't recognize you that easily you have to make some efforts to recognize for yourselves recognition is the ultimate thing why mlas wanted to become another M again mla because of the recognition why uh, people wanted uh, yeah, they get some glory they wanted to continue the glory it is because of the recognition it is the psych so as the food is for the stomach so recognition is for the mind uh, what is the mind requirement recognition identity i must be recognized as a good fellow i must be recognized as an intelligent fellow i must be recognized as a uh, as a, a fellow who is helping others i must be recognized as a a great fellow great writer great actor great something that recognition is the most important thing for the mind food is for the stomach otherwise you will be hungry you can't uh, work hard but mind also recognize this i mean want some recognition around the place and the, among in the society this is the second uh, uh, thing so for the rich people also don't think that i am already rich i need not bother about studies i need not bother about these uh, goals and all these things here yeah, that is uh, that is very bad on your part you do, if you don't bother about all these things and you don't have friends you don't have identity you don't have anything you, within your family also among your relatives also nobody bothers about you if you are rich even then you are doing well you are extremely doing well and you got a job and rejected it and you are a something special that you have to try for that anyway for most of the students you have to set your goal in terms of most of you i know most of in terms of placements and in terms of uh, higher education in terms of uh, i mean entrepreneurship also sometimes even a poor man also can be come an entrepreneur i was a very poor man but i became an entrepreneur uh, yes i tell you uh, at a later stage how you should become the entrepreneur i was a very poor man than all of you after having two post graduate degrees with the distinction but i didn't get the job <laughs> yes i am searching for the food evening <laughs> yes we can, nobody can stop us if you work hard nobody can stop us so if if we are clear in our aim yes maybe some hurdles are there when i was first starting in the combined state this uh, junior college everybody was skeptic everybody was with lots of doubts how can the people come leaving the ac college and hindu college how can the the merit students come how can they pay pay fees when they are giving for 200 rupees this man is charging 3000 rupees how can the people pay all these doubts were there i was very clear in my mind yes i am going to give a better service than ac college and hindu college people will come that's it that made me something i on any can in any situation i can give a better result better service 
better facilities than most established 100 years Hindu college, 100 years AC college. This is my clarity. That's it. <laughs> so with that kind of clarity, if you set your goal, yes, you are, go you are bound to achieve. So teachers need not pressurize, parents need not pressurize, nobody need pressurize. You are going to run on your own. You have your own answers. You have your own things. Okay, so set your goal first, what you have to become after four years. I am going to give you an assignment also after this. <laughs> so uh, yes, uh, first thing is set your goal. Without goal, you can't run in a yes. It is something like swimming in the sea. You don't know in which direction you are going. So you are uh, ultimately, you will... Uh, you have to lose your life. You have to make a clear point where you have to reach with the time frame, with the all skill set. Then, <coughs> then you, yes, you are going to reach someday, I am sure. I am sure. So this is how we have to make out. And then, the second thing, what is the preparation required for this? What is the lifestyle you have to make out from this? To prepare this. So for any game you have to prepare. You have to prepare just like that. Without food you can't play the game. Without a reasonable skill you can't play the game. And you, yes, you, so you have to prepare what is the kind of lifestyle you have to make out. The first thing, everybody talks about you do well, you study well, study well, study well. I am not talking about that. <laughs> the first thing is about your health. Your health should be good. Otherwise you can't do anything. Very few people bother about your uh, or health, but that is the basic thing that makes you feel good and work good and uh, do good things. First thing is about your health. We are going to have the checkup also after some days for everybody. Yes, everybody, whether you, you have enough blood or not, uh, any issues are there, health issues and all these things, we are going to have the checkup. Every student has to undergo that process. Health is the most important thing. So what it, uh, some, if some, I see some of the people, especially girls, they look like seventh class students. A very lean, very hungry kind of thing and uh, with, uh, I mean, very, with, uh, 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 not with good blood, all these things, they, they, appear like that because they are not uh, uh, doing, uh, taking care of their health properly. So what is the requirement for the basic requirement for the health? The basic requirement as all of you are know, uh, know very well, it is the food. Food you have to take. Uh, Sufficient food. You can, you can uh, more than the required also. Nothing will happen at this age. You have to take more food also. Nothing will happen. This age is the growing age for you. Uh, you can't be fat. You can't be uh, bad or something. You can take enough food at hostel, at home. The whole problem is most of you do not know what to eat. So if I look at the, uh, I mean, your uh, tiffin boxes, it contains 90% of the rice and 10% of the curries. Even in the hostels also, that is the same situation, which is a very, very bad situation. Carbohydrates, uh, the rice gives the carbohydrates. Okay, it fills the stomach, but it won't give you your energy. 
So you require a, a reasonable fat, you require uh, minerals, you require uh, micronutrients. All these things are not available in the rice. They are available in the curries only and different curries. So from tomorrow you tell your mother <laughs> that fill the uh, tiffin box with 50% of rice and 50% of the curries. <laughs> oh, yes, you see the glow after one month. You see your glow after one month. It will be greatly improved, I am telling you. Even hostlers also. So it may be costly to me, but it is very good if your health is good. If you, if you take more curries, it may be expensive for me. Fine. I don't bother about you. Your health is most important than my, uh, this thing expenditure. Yes. Your health is most. I know very well that in intermediate colleges and hostels, they don't bother about the food. Even if you or your parent asks about the food, quality of food and all that, they always give the reply, you came here for studies, not for food. This is the standard reply. Naturally, you will be convinced and your parents are also, yes, I came for here for studies, for the um, good marks, not for food. But the, the interesting part is, without energy, without good food, without blood, you can't have the... Uh, good concentration, good marks, good study. They don't know, even if they don't know, they don't talk. Yes, Might, must be, they I feel that they don't know. The whole process is, the blood carries oxygen to brain. The brain always works. Is it? More the oxygen, the brain concentration would be more, more the brain works. If, yeah, to have it, it more oxygen means you need to have more blood in your body. For more blood, you have to have good food. That is the whole science. Otherwise, you must have experienced you get sleep, you get tiredness, you get, uh, uh, I mean, sometimes if you are hungry, you are angry. <laughs> You are frustrated. Yes, you are frustrated. You are angry towards teachers, angry towards management, angry towards everybody around you. So because you are hungry. You are hungry. Anger is out of hungry. Hunger. Yeah, yes, it requires because in the entire body, perhaps you do not know, entire body, what we feel, how the energy is consumed, if you walk, energy is consumed, if you do work, energy is consumed, if you play, energy is consumed. No, that's all okay. But 25 to 30 percent of the energy is consumed by the brain. Yes. Whatever the food you have, whatever the energy we Get it, 25 to 30 percent of the energy is spent by the brain. If we open our brains and put the electrical bulb, it lights. That is the energy. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. So that, that uh, energy, that brain demands lot of energy, lot of uh, blood, lot of food. That you, most of you uh, 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 don't bother about that. So the food also should be the equal mixture of carbo carbohydrates should be there. I am not denying, don't take rice and all that. You take rice, but to the extent of 50, 60 percent, other 40, 50 percent, yes, uh, this thing, uh, curries. Curries, different curries will have different minerals, micronutrients and all that. So this is the way you have to take food, hostlers especially. Have good food, nothing will happen if you, 
you normally eat uh, three, four idlis. Even if you eat six idlis, nothing will happen. <laughs> nothing will happen. But only my request is, of course, I tell you in the last uh, phase also, in the hostels, don't waste food. Uh, yes, don't waste food. I will tell you this uh, the afterwards also. Wasting food, uh, don't, uh, not to waste food for three reasons. One reason is, uh, you know pretty well, there are many people, thousands of people suffering from hunger. You are not feeding them directly. At least if you don't waste it, you are indirectly feeding them. That is number one. Number two, so for the rice what we are getting, the farmers are sweating for three, four months to get rice. But we are simply wasting it, throwing it. We are throwing their sweat. Horrible. Horrible. They are working day in and day out for three, four months to get a crop. We are just throwing out. And the third sentimental is, as per the spiritually, if you, if you waste food, deny the food, some way food will deny you. <laughs> Maybe a, a, a point may see, you may see a point where food is not available for you. So, eat more. I am happy. Nothing will happen. Karpula no piradu, unko no piradu, ye no pillrao. Bayat hinindi. Yes, eat more. If you are habituated at home or in the other messes for two, three idlis, eat six. Two, three dosa, eat five, six. And one or two the poor is eat six, seven. Nothing will happen. <laughs> Nothing will happen. Yes. Eat more, consume more, but don't waste it, that's it. Don't waste it. Yes. So, if you eat a plate, you can 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 eat a plate. मैं मैं तल्लल की चालावंदी चादर न दो चाला मैं तल्लल गोड़ा चालावंदी कोण दो। What they look at you after twenty days is how you are eating food before this and after this. They will be the happiest people if you are eating more food and that too very cleanly way. That too in a very cleanly way if you are eating they are the happiest people. They don't know about your physics or mathematics or sea language. How you are eating, they look at, especially mother look at you. So if you are eating well, they, will, they are the happiest people. This is the change happened in 15 days. They don't know about your learning. This is the virtual change I am looking at you. So eat more and don't waste. And uh, yeah. The other thing is about your uh, neatness. Neatness, okay, fine, I am okay with dress and other things. Inside, how much you are uh, uh, clean and neat? Have the bo bath both morning and evening. Most of you are not habituated to take the bath uh, two times. Uh, if you are uh, one, one uh, this thing, uh, okay, fine. So, that is not good for you because because what happens if I take the bath? I am giving you a very detailed thing. What happens if you take the bath? If you take the bath, the water, uh, I mean, stimulates the body. Yeah, yes, without the bath, if we, a chapter, uh, an essay takes you for two hours, and with bath, you can complete the same thing in one hour. Because the whole body gets stimulated. I think as children you do not know, in the olden days, most of the diseases are cured by water. That is called water therapy. Most of the diseases are cured by water only. 
water has that impact. All of you are aware, I think you have seen in the movies. So if somebody wants to learn the dance, if somebody wants to write a big uh, book and all that, if you, somebody wants to learn the music, we, uh, in the olden days what they used to do is go to the river, have a dip and, on the, uh, and then start the dance, start the music. That was the olden system because the whole flowing water, it is the dynamic uh, this thing. Kinetic energy would be there in the flowing water, all of you are aware. Kinetic energy would be there. That will energize the body. That stimulates the body. That makes you feel better. That makes you full with more concentration. That makes you uh, wonderful. Yes. Though you don't have the dust and other things, have bath both morning and evening. Yes, compulsorily. Uh, I know that 30-40% of the people don't have the habit of the second time bath. <laughs> but try to start that. <laughs> That's a good thing. Initially, okay, it may be a, a bit uh, a change of habit, a bit of problem. But you can do that. And the third thing is, have some exercise, very normal exercise. Normal exercise uh, means you can walk, you can play something, you have a, I mean, outdoor gym kind of thing, no. outdoor gym kind of thing, and all these things are there. Uh, you can, you know, I am not seeing anybody hostless in the, after 4 o'clock. It's very bad thing. I wanted to see you all through playing. More than the classes, that is more important for me. Or for you also. You have to play. Yes. Otherwise, how can you get the energy? It needs to be digested. It needs to be consumed. So eat more and have more energy, more exercise. So learn something. Or even without any skill also, you can do the outdoor gym. Yes. So you can have the some running on the track. We have beautiful grounds. No university around this place got these kinds of ground. Beautifully well-prepared grounds. Well-prepared, ready to play. So that kind of grounds, you have to full, I want to see full of people on the ground. I am, I, I give equal importance, okay, people have come to the classes, Srinivas tells me. But on the other side, people have come to the ground. Yes, the yes, large number should come. Who stopped you? It's only your mindset. You are not having studied in a school because you have studied in apartments. You have not studied, done it in uh, intermediate, that is also in apartment. So you have not face anything in the ground. Well, it's not too late. You start now. Then you will become uh, beautiful. You will become good. Healthy also appears to be beautiful. See, beauty for girls, I am telling, beauty always you believe that it comes from the dresses. It comes from the beauty salons. And uh, uh, from uh, this thing. No, beauty never comes to, uh, like that. Real beauty never comes to, like that. Beauty comes from your food, uh, food the blood pot you have. That is it. So along with that food, good blood flowing, you have to have more exercise. Then the, the, that is the, the real glow is there on your faces. Real glow. No scent or no powder, no beauty salon gives the real beauty for you. The good food, good exercise gives you beautiful. And the, the structure of the body also would be good. That is the real beauty. We are powder good good to the other end of the gun to the other, and the chiragga on to the other pitch gun to the 
అలా డ్రెస్ చేసుకుంటే కూడా ఏమి ఉండదు సో ఏం డ్రెస్ చేసుకున్నా అందంగా ఉండాలి బ్రహ్మాండంగా ఉండాలి సో ఉండాలి అంటే యూ షుడ్ హ్యావ్ అ గుడ్ హెల్త్ ఫర్ దాట్ యూ నీడ్ టు హ్యావ్ గుడ్ ఫుడ్ అండ్ దీస్ అండ్ ద సెకండ్ ద థర్డ్ పార్ట్ ఈస్ హ్యావ్ ద రెగ్యులర్ అటెండెన్స్ సో నార్మల్లీ ఎస్ ఓకే ఫర్ వన్స్ ఇన్ టెన్ డేస్ ఆర్ వన్ డే ఆర్ టూ డేస్ ఆబ్సెంట్ వాట్ విల్ హ్యాపీన్ ఐఎమ్ ఐ హ్యావ్ ఆల్రెడీ అటెండెడ్ టెన్ డేస్ ఫిఫ్టీన్ డేస్ ఓన్లీ వన్ డే నథింగ్ సో సమ్టైమ్స్ వెన్ 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 ద ఇంట్రడక్షన్ ఈస్ ద డన్ ఆన్ దట్ ఆబ్సెంట్ డే బికాస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ ఈజ్ అ కంటిన్యూస్ సబ్జెక్ట్ ఎ లాసికల్ సబ్జెక్ట్ వన్స్ యూ మిస్ ద ఇంట్రడక్షన్ ద నెక్స్ట్ సెవెన్ డేస్ దో యూ ఆర్ సిట్టింగ్ ఇన్ ద క్లాస్ యూ కాంట్ అండర్స్టాండ్ ఇన్ you can't understand anything and also you are prepare yourselves to be a professional professional means more than 5% 10% absence won't be accepted by any company so you have to have you habituate to this you have to habituate right from the beginning so in the same way the punctuality come on time so yeah it's a rule i don't we don't punish you but yes it is yet yeah, we make you learn naturally if you are late i can fine you if you are absent we can fine you that is what many universities at chennai and other places and they do lots of nonsense but we don't punish you but we make you feel what is right and what is wrong what happens if you are late by 10 minutes only 10 minutes what happens other 60 people of your class are disturbed for 5 minutes because the, the lecturer look at, uh, should look at him and should give the permission to come inside and the whole 60 people get uh, disturbed they lose 5 minutes of their time 300 minutes are wasted for your 10 minutes 60 into 5 <laughs> yes 300 minutes are wasted for your later 5 minutes <laughs> not worth doing <laughs> is it and then the fourth part of your lifestyle is i know that cell phone became the uh, regular uh, this thing but uh, uh, i can't say that you should not use cell phone because you need to have something but try to use it for its own purpose that means for communication but don't be busy yourselves with the cell phone here what you are talking with the what you are doing with the cell phone is you are leaving the next fellow immediate fellow and talking to a fellow who is at 50 kilometers distance <laughs> not what to do you are eating away their time i mean your uh, the whole phone system is eating away your time and with bad messages bad temper bad uh, i mean lot of disturbance so try to use your cell phone somebody is uh, using the bad words against somebody you are not involved but you are enjoying it you are literally enjoying it what is the um, i mean uh, your your hormones get uh, i mean going bad you are enjoying the bad thing you have to enjoy the good things so try to use the cell phone only for communication not to do the other things that is the trick the cell phone manager managers have a trick see what the trick is uh, the facebook fellow has uh, expressed the same thing in the interview the trick is if you enter into the facebook he will tell you and he, your photo will come next 10 minutes he with the title you are beautiful so he is telling i am beautiful so i am uh, into that naturally <laughs> anybody uh, if somebody tells about me you are great so i am into that if somebody tells you are beautiful handsome you are into that you are trapped you are trapped 
what that fellow is saying you will you will get surprised to know facebook fellow what is your competitor what is who is your enemy is it twitter or is it uh, whatsapp fellow or is it uh, any other fellow no these are not my competitors these are not whatsapp is not my competitor twitter is not my competitor my competitor is the sleep of the people <laughs> oh, people should not sleep that is what he is imagining <laughs> he, they, he, if you don't sleep he will get money more money that is how you are you are trapped you are engaged you are going to see till the 11 o'clock 12 o'clock kind of thing you are he, he, they are taking your sleep straight understood they are taking away your sleep so avoid yeah, learn to avoid the cell phone nothing will happen if you avoid the cell phone i don't uh, i don't keep my cell phone in my office i keep it uh, at a distance i don't have any problem on any day though i am maintaining 40 institutions operating with 60 70000 of students i don't have any problem no problem you yes you try that is the biggest enemy for you in your hand is, the biggest enemy for you is nowhere at a distance it is in your hand <laughs> yes he is taking away your time that is taking away your sleep that is taking away your comfort that is taking away your happiness biggest enemy is in your hand you are operating with that <laughs> and uh, try to dress up properly of course you will be given uh, uh, uniform kind of thing and you dress. so girls i actually proposed pant and shirt so but these people have purchased the previous dress only because it 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 improves your confidence level when you are in pant and shirt it improves the way you walk the way you talk to the others the way you behave with others yes it is, uh, i am no way less than any boy this is the feeling you will get it when changing the dress <laughs> so uh, dress uh, yes <laughs> dress will have an impact uh, suppose a policeman is there imagine him without dress no you don't bother about him huh so once he has the dress you 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 are attend to towards him a doctor is there imagine him without apron you can't feel that he is a doctor when with apron and set he is a doctor it has a lot of impact on our uh, feeling and our personality that is the reason i asked these people to go for uh, okay we are doing it at nirula for a long time we we'll go for that but but they have already ordered uh, normal things <laughs> anyway we we are going to have a choice also <laughs> so yes so this is the yes so these are the basic lifestyles you have to maintain oh it's a time up <laughs> so uh, <laughs> so basic lifestyles you have to maintain one thing is about the health uh, and food and exercise and attendance and uh, i mean regularity punctuality these are the professional requirements professionalism requirements and the third and the other thing is uh, we, as far as as will avoid the cell phone this is the uh, yes to reach your goal to re yes this is the basic things you have to cultivate me andarki swagatham suswagatham gana swagatham <laughs> good so we other ke kontha mandi doubts undu untai inga physics chemistry mall battle chaala time undi em tondra padakkarla kangar padakkarla meer mundu avu enduku chadavali enti chadavali etla chadavali enduku college raavali any basic things ka answers karu meer convince aithe 
అప్పుడు యూ కెన్ రన్ ఆన్ యువర్ ఓన్ యూ కెన్ ఫైట్ ఆన్ యువర్ ఓన్ యూ కెన్ విన్ ఆన్ యువర్ ఓన్ అంతే కదా సో సో అది దాంట్లో ముందు చాలా ఇంపార్టెంట్ మీరు ఒక గోల్ లక్ష్యం ఏర్ప ఏర్పరచుకోవటం నేను ఎందుకు మీ లక్ష్యాన్ని ఏర్పరచుకోవటానికి మీకు మీ ఇంట్లో పరిస్థితులు తెలుసు ఇప్పుడు చాలామంది చెప్పరు మన ఇంట్లో ఎంత ఇబ్బంది ఉందని కానీ తెలుసుకోండి తెలుసుకోవటం మంచిది ఎందుకంటే వీళ్ళు మీరు బాధపడతారని చెప్పరు తెలుసుకోండి మనకి ఎన్ని ఎంత ధాన్యం పడింది ఎంత రేట్ వస్తుంది ఎంత డబ్బులు వస్తాయి ఏంటి మన అన్నకి ఎట్లా ఫీజు కడుతున్నారు నాకు ఎట్లా ఫీజు కడుతున్నారు నథింగ్ రాంగ్ ఇన్ లెర్నింగ్ తెలుసుకోండి మోస్ట్ ఆఫ్ యూ నాకు తెలిసినంతలో మిడిల్ క్లాస్ లోవర్ మిడిల్ క్లాస్ కొంతమంది ధనవంతులు ఉంటే ఉండొచ్చు దిస్ ఈజ్ ఇట్ ఏమైనా సరే మీరు లక్ష్యం పెట్టుకోవాలి మీరు ఆ ఇబ్బందులు తెలిస్తే భయంకరంగా ఉంటాయి ఇబ్బందులు చాలా భయంకరంగా ఉంటాయి సో ఆ ఇబ్బందులు తెలిస్తే ఇట్లాంటి ఇబ్బందులు నాలుగు సంవత్సరాల తర్వాత ఉండకూడదు నాకు కానీ మా ఫ్యామిలీకి కానీ అంటే ఏం చేయాలి నేను అంతే నాకు బాగా చదువుక మంచి ఉద్యోగం రావాలి అది కూడా నాలుగైదు లక్షలు కాదు ఏడెనిమిది లక్షలు పది లక్షల ఉద్యోగం రావాలి అని ఒక లక్ష్యాన్ని పెట్టుకోవాలి దెన్ మామూలుగా అడిగితే మీరు ఎందుకు కాలేజీకి వస్తున్నారు అంటే పేరెంట్స్ పొమ్మన్నారు ఫీజు కట్టాము లేకపోతే టీచర్లు పోట్లాడతారు లేకపోతే ఇంకోటి అవద్దు అని అంటారు దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ద రైట్ ఆన్సర్స్ రైట్ ఆన్సర్ మీరు ఒకసారి లక్ష్యం ఏర్పరచుకున్న తర్వాత మీకు ఎందుకు కాలేజీకి వస్తున్నారంటే నాకు పెద్ద డ్రీమ్ ఉంది మీ మనసులో మీకు సమాధానం చెప్పుకోవాలి నాకు ఆ డ్రీమ్ ఆ లక్ష్యం చేరుకోవాలి కాబట్టి నేను రోజు కాలేజీకి వస్తున్నా ఎందుకు కష్టపడుతున్నానంటే గ్యారంటీగా మిగతా వాళ్ళ కంటే బాగా చేయాలి నాకు బెటర్ ఉద్యోగం రావాలి కాబట్టి నేను ఇది ఎక్కువ కష్టపడుతున్నా ఎస్ దీస్ ఆర్ ద సమ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఆన్సర్స్ యూ కెన్ మేక్ యువర్ సెల్స్ అండ్ డూ యువర్ సెల్స్ సో అది గోల్ సెట్టింగ్ ఈస్ ద మోస్ట్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్ లేకపోతే ఎటు పోతున్నామో తెలియదు ఎందుకు వెళ్తున్నామో తెలియదు ఎప్పటికి వెళ్తామో తెలియదు మీకు అన్నీ తెలియాలి ఎటు వెళ్తున్నారో తెలియాలి ఎప్పటికి వెళ్తారో తెలియాలి ఎంత సాధిస్తారో తెలియాలి ఎస్ ఇఫ్ యూ ఫిక్స్ దాట్ యు ఆర్ బౌండ్ టు గెట్ ఇట్ అవుతుంది అంటే ముందు బ్యాచులకి అయిపోయి అయింది కదా అందరికీ వచ్చిన ఉద్యోగాలు అరవై పర్సెంట్ అరవై రెండు పర్సెంట్ ఇంటర్మీడియట్లో వచ్చి ఎందుకు పనికి రాదు ఏమీ ర్యాంక్ రాదు అనుకున్నాడు కూడా ఏడెనిమిది లక్షలు ఉద్యోగాలు వచ్చేసి ఎస్ ఎస్ వాళ్ళందరూ వాళ్ళందరూ చేస్తే అప్పుడు బాధపడతా ఉన్నారు అది చేర్చినప్పుడు సరే ముందు ఏవో ఎంసెట్లో ర్యాంక్ రాలేదు మా జీవ మా వాడి జీవితం అయిపోయింది మా అమ్మ జీవితం అయిపోయింది అది అయిపోయింది అంత పోయింది అని ఏమీ పోలేదు ఏమీ పోలేదు వి మేడ్ ఇట్ నాట్ వన్ ఆర్ టూ పీపుల్ మోర్ దాన్ టూ టూ ఫిఫ్టీన్ హండ్రెడ్ పీపుల్ ఎస్ సో ది ఫస్ట్ థింగ్ మీ మనకి తెలియాలి మనం ఎట్టు వెళ్తున్నాము ఎందుకు వెళ్తున్నాము ఎంత ఎంత సాధిస్తాము అని దాట్ యూ షుడ్ ఫిక్స్ ఇన్ టర్మ్స్ ఆఫ్ ప్లేస్మెంట్ కావచ్చు హైర్ ఎడ్యుకేషన్ కావచ్చు లేకపోతే డబ్బులు ఉంటే ఎంటర్ప్రీనర్స్ కావచ్చు దిస్ ఈజ్ ఇట్ ద సెకండ్ థింగ్ మీకు లైఫ్ దీనికి సరిపడా జస్ట్ అనుకుంటే సరిపోదు అన్ని పుస్తకాలు రాస్తారు డ్రీమ్ హై డ్రీమ్ హై అని డ్రీమ్ హై అయితే వాట్ ఐ టు ప్రిపేర్ మై సెల్ఫ్ ఫర్ దట్ ఎప్పుడు కళల్లో ఉంటే ఏమవుద్ది ఏం కాదు కళలు మంచిగా నిజంగా అవ్వాలి అవ్వాలంటే వీ హెట్ పుట్ సమ్ ఎఫర్ట్ ఆ ఎఫర్ట్ ఏంటి అంటే ఒకటి హెల్త్ బాగుండాలి బాగా తినాలి బాగా ఎక్సర్సైజ్ చేయాలి బాగా తినాలి మీ ఏజ్లో ఎంత తిన్నా ఏం కాదు ఐఎమ్ ద హ్యాపీయెస్ట్ మ్యాన్ ఇఫ్ యూ ఈట్ మోర్ ఇఫ్ యూ కన్సీవ్ మోర్ ఎస్ దాంతో పాటు ఎంతో కొంత ఎక్సర్సైజ్ చేయండి పది నిమిషాలు ఇరవై నిమిషాలు అరగంట మీకు ఇష్టం వచ్చేంత దిస్ ఈజ్ ద ఫస్ట్ థింగ్ సెకండ్ థింగ్ అటెండెన్స్ రెగ్యులర్గా ఉండేట్టు చూడండి ఎన్ని ఇంజనీరింగ్ కోర్సులు అన్ని లాజికల్గా ఉంటాయి కాబట్టి అది అయ్యేటట్టు చూడండి థర్డ్ థింగ్ పంక్చువాలిటీ ఆన్ టైం ఉండేట్టు ప్రోగ్రామ్స్ కదా అంతా ఆన్ టైంలో ఉండేట్టు అండ్ థర్డ్ అండ్ ద అదర్ థింగ్ ఈజ్ ఎస్ అవాయిడ్ ద సెల్ ఫోన్ యాజ్ మచ్ యాజ్ పాసిబుల్ సెల్ ఫోన్ సరే తప్పని పరిస్థితి తప్పని ఇన్స్ట్రుమెంట్ మీకు కూడా మేము అందరికీ కంప్యూటర్లు ఉండేటట్టు చూస్తాం కా అంత మాత్రం చేత అది మన్నీ డామినేట్ చేసేట్టు చూడకూడదు ఎలా చేయకూడదు 
సెల్ ఫోన్ షుడ్ నాట్ మన టైం మన చేతుల్లో ఉండాలి సెల్ ఫోన్ ఇష్టం చేట ఉండకూడదు మనం ఆడుకోవాలంటే ఆడుకోవాలి అంతేగాని సెల్ ఫోన్ చూస్తా కూర్చుంటే ఎట్లా మనం తినాలంటే శుభ్రంగా సెల్ ఫోన్ అవతల పడేసి హాయిగా రుచికరంగా తినాలి అంతేగాని సెల్ ఫోన్ చూస్తా తింటే మీకేం రుచి తెలుస్తుంది అవును మనం ఏదైనా డాన్స్ వేయాలంటే ఏడు డాన్స్ వేయాలి పాట పాడాలంటే పాడాలి అంటే సెల్ ఫోన్లో పాటలు వింటే సెల్ ఫోన్లో డాన్స్ వేస్తే మీకే వస్తుంది సో అది దాన్ని మన చేతుల్లో పెట్టుకోవాలి కానీ దాని చేతుల్లోకి మనం వెళ్ళకూడదు ఆ ట్రాప్లోకి మనం వెళ్ళకూడదు ఎస్ ఎనీథింగ్ ఎనీ అడ్వాన్స్ ఎనీ టెక్నాలజీ హ్యాస్ బోత్ సైడ్స్ న్యూక్లియర్ వేపన్ ఉంది మీ అందరూ తెలుసు పవర్ బ్రహ్మాండంగా చేయొచ్చు అట్లానే బాంబింగ్ చేయొచ్చు చంపవచ్చు చాలామందిని వీ కాన్ డినై ద న్యూక్లియర్ టెక్నాలజీ చంపొచ్చు బాంబులు తయారు చేశారు కాబట్టి న్యూక్లియర్ టెక్నాలజీ వద్దనుకోవటం లేదు న్యూక్లియర్ టెక్నాలజీ ఈజ్ దేర్ ఇన్ ట్రీటింగ్ క్యాన్సర్ ఇన్ ప్రొడ్యూసింగ్ పవర్ ఇన్ డూయింగ్ లాట్స్ ఆఫ్ థింగ్స్ గుడ్ థింగ్స్ సో ఎస్ సో అది మీ దీంట్లో ఉండేటట్టు చూడండి అది మీ కంట్రోల్లో ఉండేటట్టు చూడండి అంతేకాని డోంట్ బీ ఇన్ టు ఇట్స్ కంట్రోల్ సో అప్పుడు మీకు చాలామంది ఫ్రెండ్స్ అవుతారు పక్కన వాళ్ళతో ఎక్కువసేపు మాట్లాడతారు వాళ్ళతో షేర్ చేసుకుంటారు వాళ్ళతో అన్ని పంచుకుంటారు యు విల్ హ్యావ్ మోర్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ ఫ్రెండ్స్ విత్ ఇన్ ద క్యాంపస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎ గుడ్ థింగ్ సో ది అండ్ అదర్ థింగ్స్ బీ అండ్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్ పొద్దున్నే సాయంత్రం తప్పకుండా స్నానం చేయండి సో అది చాలా మీరు చూడండి ఒక ఐదారు రోజుల తర్వాత యు ఫీల్ ఫ్రెష్ యు ఫీల్ ఎనర్జైజ్డ్ యు ఫీల్ గుడ్ ఆఫ్ యువర్ సెల్స్ మిమ్మల్ని మీకు మీకే మంచిగా అనిపిస్తుంది సో హ్యావ్ ద అందుట్లో మీకు చాలా మాకైనా ఎవరికైనా అవసరం మీకు చాలా ఏజ్లో చాలా సెక్రీషన్స్ వస్తాయి బాడీలో నుంచి సో ఆ సెక్రీషన్స్ మీకు తెలియదు అంటే కనపడు ఒక కంటికి బట్ సెక్రీషన్స్ వస్తాయి అది క్లీన్ చేస్తూ ఉంటే కానీ మీకు ఫ్రెష్ ఫీలింగ్ ఉండదు అండ్ వాటర్ ఆల్వేస్ స్టిమ్యులేట్స్ ద బాడీ సో ఐ టోల్ యూ టూ పూర్వకాలంలో ఏం చేయాలన్నా సరే స్నానం చేసిన తర్వాత మొదలుపెట్టారు పూజ చేయాలంటే స్నానం అది వేణ మ్యూజిక్ నేర్చుకోవాలంటే స్నానం చేస్తారు నదిలో దిగుతారు ఏదైనా రాయాలంటే నదిలో దిగుతారు ఏదైనా డ్యాన్స్ నేర్చుకోవాలంటే నదిలో వాటర్ స్టిమ్యులేట్స్ దట్ అవును ఎవ్వరు ఎట్టి పరిస్థితుల్లోనూ స్నానం చేయకుండా భోజనం చేసేవాళ్ళు కాదు పూర్వకాలంలో దట్స్ ఇట్ బికాస్ యుల్ ఫీల్ హంగ్రీ యూ కెన్ ఈట్ మోర్ సో దిస్ ఈజ్ ద బేసిక్ లైఫ్ స్టైల్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు మెయింటైన్ సో ఇప్పుడు మీకు అసైన్మెంట్ ఏంటంటే రెండు రోజుల్లోకి రాయండి వాట్ ఈస్ యువర్ గోల్ వాట్ the uh, be, uh, what is your goal depending upon the situation of your family me family situation and uh, what is what are your strengths and weaknesses and the third part is wha- how we are go- i mean what are the uh, what is the lifestyle you have to you are going to maintain the uh, i mean uh, to reach the your goal lifestyle you are going to change or adapt to reach your goal this is the assignment 200 words 300 words majila raindi nenu oka example cheptuna i am so and so my father is so and so we have uh, uh, six acres of land we have we have this kind of revenue and we have uh, two children uh, myself and my brother and my brother is studying like this our uh, expenditure uh, fees and all these things would be like this that is the fact. so to remove all these my problems and my parents are suffering to pay the fees and all that and so to remove all these things to make the myself and my family happy family i yes my goal is i to get a big job of not less than 7 8 lakhs and in the in the companies like so and so these years cognizant and alois and other companies are right okay three four and then what is the lifestyle i am going to adopt for this so lifestyle i i'll maintain my health good taking good food good sleep and good sleep is also equally important sleep is also equally important 
so good food good uh, exercise and good sleep and also attend the classes regularly and punctually and uh, take up the other i mean participate in other cultural and uh, extracurricular activities also edavti this is the basic thing me ishtam vachinda rayandi telugu lo rasina parla english lo rasina parla don't hesitate నేను ఇంగ్లీష్ నాకు అంత బాగా రాదు నేను కాన్ఫిడెంట్ కాదు అనుకోకర్లేదు ఇంగ్లీష్లో రాస్తారు ఆయన తప్పులైనా పర్లే మేమే అను మీరే తప్పులు చేస్తారు మేమే కరెక్ట్ చేయాలి లేకపోతే మేమెందుకు మీ తప్పులు లేకపోతే మేమెందుకు మేము కరెక్ట్ చేసుకోవడానికి కదా ఉంది యూ టు మేక్ మిస్టేక్స్ వే టు కరెక్ట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ అవర్ జాబ్ సో అందుకని మీరు దేంట్లో రాసినా పర్లేదు ఇంగ్లీష్లో రాసినా పర్లేదు తెలుగులో రాసినా పర్లేదు రాసి మీ మెంటార్స్కి ఫ్రైడే కల్లా ఇవ్వండి ఓకే సో ఫ్రైడే ఈవినింగ్ కల్లా ఇవ్వండి మీ మెంటార్స్కి సో ఫ్రైడే ఏంటి హాలిడే సా పోనీ సాటర్డే సో సో సాటర్డే ఈవినింగ్కి ఇవ్వండి దిస్ ఈజ్ ద అసైన్మెంట్ అండర్స్టాండ్ నేను అసైన్మెంట్ ఏం రాయాలో కూడా చెప్పేశాను దాదాపు అయితే ఎవ్రీబడీ స్టోరీ ఈజ్ డిఫరెంట్ మీ మీ నాన్నగారి పేర్లు ఎవరికి ఉండవు మీ అమ్మగారి పేర్లు ఎవరికి ఉండవు మీకున్న ఆస్తి వేరే వాళ్ళకి ఉండదు మీకున్న అంబిషన్ వేరే వాళ్ళకి ఉండదు ఎవ్రీబడీ స్టోరీ బేసిక్ లైన్ ఈజ్ దిస్ దిస్ ఈజ్ హౌ యూ టు మేక్ యువర్ సెల్ఫ్ దీంట్లో ఏం తెలుస్తుంది అంటే వాట్ ఈజ్ ఇట్ యూ ఆర్ అని తెలుస్తుంది రెండోది మీరు ఎంత అంబిషన్స్ అది తెలుస్తుంది మూడోది మీ రైటింగ్ స్కిల్స్ అంటే ఎట్లా ఉన్నాయి అది అంతా తెలుస్తుంది మీ ఏదైనా డిఫికల్టీస్ ఉంటే కూడా అవి కూడా మీకు తెలుస్తుంది మాకు కూడా తెలుస్తుంది ఇట్ వుడ్ బి వండర్ఫుల్ ఓకే సో వన్స్ అగైన్ విష్ యూ ఆల్ ద బెస్ట్ గుడ్ లక్ థ్యాంక్ యూ